Ndi bayana sasa wa Kenya wanapitia wakati mgumu kupata vieti wanavyohitaji kama vya kuzaliwa na vya wapendo wao wanapoaga. YCC imefichua hayo kupitia kwa mkurugenzi wa huduma Vincent Okongo ambapo asilimia tisa hivi vya wa Kenya wanadai kutoa mlungula. In terms of bribery payments you can see that uh, 62.2% paid bribes from the, those who sought services and that has increased slightly to 73.1%. Ajabu hali si tofauti katika hospitali za umma. Bima ya kitaifa ya hospitali NHIF inatajwa kusheheni ufisadi mwaka mmoja baada aliyekuwa afisa mkuu wake Geoffrey Mwangi kujipata kizimbani. Under the command of Inspector Dare ya polisi kwa mara nyingine ikijipata katika orodha ya taasisi fisadi zaidi ikifuatiwa na kampuni ya Kenya Power, Wizara za Kilimo, Ardhi na Vituo vya Huduma Center pia havikuachwa nyuma. Kenyans are saying that for them to get services that they demand or they deserve, they have to pay a price. 50% say that. And that was followed by 28.6% which said that it is the only way to hasten the process of getting that service county za bomet kericho garissa narok nyamira na makueni zina idadi kubwa ya wakenya wasio hofia kutoa hongo ili kupata huduma zozote zile za serikali ambazo zinapaswa kuwa za bila malipo In terms of the number of average bribes demanded by counties and this shows the behavior of the public officer because they are the ones demanding bribes You can see that Tana River is now leading. Public officers in Tana River County are demanding more bribes followed by Kilifi, Wajia, Migori, Kisi, Vihiga uh, in that order. Angela Cheror, K24, Samoja.